The Flames are in Winnipeg for a quick one game road trip as they look for their third win in a row. Everybody, happy new year and welcome to game day. Welcome to Winnipeg where the Calgary Flames are looking to kick off 2023 the same way they closed out 2022 and that is of course with a victory. The Flames are coming off a 3-2 win over the Vancouver Canucks on New Year's Eve. It was a big night for Mackenzie Weger who scored his first goal as a Calgary Flame and his first goal in 39 games. The win was Calgary's second in a row as they get set to face a Winnipeg Jets team that has also won two straight. This will be the Jets' first outing of a three-game homestand, and they've been pretty solid at Canada Life Centre with a record of 13-6 and six this season. Winnipeg is currently second in the Central Division. They are also coming off a New Year's Eve victory, a 2-1 decision over Edmonton. Calgary, as I mentioned, also winners of two straight after a very busy December that saw them play 16 games and pick up points in 12 of them. Their last win moved them into third place in the Pacific, one point ahead of Seattle and Edmonton as they get set to play a Jets team coached by Rick Bonus, who, of course, Daryl Sutter is very familiar with considering the playoffs last season. Knowing that Rick's coached in Winnipeg now and that he coached Dallas before, so we played Dallas in the playoffs last year and they play a very similar style to Dallas, so you go back can you look at you know where a lot of their chances came from, where where they're coming from? Um, if you look at Winnipeg right now, they're there's they are right at the top of the league in terms of on the rush, and a lot of that is their defense defense involvement in plays. So you see that with Winnipeg this year. Here's a look at who to watch tonight. Mark Scheifele is hot for the Jets right now. He leads the team in goals with 23 and has found the back of the net eight times in Winnipeg's last 10 games. For the visitors, Blake Coleman scored a shorthanded marker against Vancouver but was lamenting he should have had more goals after a game-high seven shots and two breakaways. So we will have to see if he can carry that same energy over into tonight. As for the rest of the lineup, Daryl Sutter mentioned that Brett Ritchie is making progress, but it looks like Radim Zahorna will get the start for the Flames tonight. Game time here in Winnipeg is 7 p.m., 6 p.m. Mountain Time. <laughs>